Hi, I'm going to show you a great tip of how to do an invisible decrease single crochet two together. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, I'm going to show you the way that I was taught. You insert your hook, grab the yarn, and then insert your hook into the next stitch, grab the yarn, then yarn over and pull through all three loops. That's the way I was taught, but there's a new way if you have never been taught is you go into the front loop and then into the next stitch of the front loop. And if this is your first time doing this, it is a little tricky at first. Um, these type of hooks that I'm using, the Susan hooks, are really great for grabbing that yarn. So the two front loops in both of the stitches. Then you yarn over, pull through two loops, then yarn over and pull through two loops. And as you can see, it looks like it's one stitch rather than two stitches. So this makes it look like it's invisible when you add two stitches together for a decrease. Now I'm going to show you again, you go into that front loop and then you can go into the next front loop and then you yarn over and pull through two loops and then yarn over and pull through two loops. And this is how you do the invisible two single crochet decrease together. It's a pretty great way to make it look like it's one stitch and it's not as bulky. I really like this way of doing it. Okay, thank you for watching and please subscribe.